yes guys um right we are still here right it's a continuity of 6.3 yes um we are continuing from our video one then this is the video two of 6.3 uh remember but uh question six june 2023 so let's um, let's try to work out this guys no? so in this case we are given zero is equal to 2ax uh, minus b all over 1x squared we need to multiply this let's work it out this let's work it out yes so when it's like this this is what you're going to do zero is equal to 2a x minus then b times one is going to be b uh, one times x squared is going to be x squared okay remember that uh, I told you that uh, this happens when the derivative of h of 2 is equal to 0, meaning that where there is a, a, a x, you're going to replace it by 2. So it's going to be b all over 2 squared. So we have, um, we have what? 2a two, two times, uh, two a times 4 is going to be 4a, as well as uh, 2 squared, that's going to be 4. So we have b all over 4. Remember, we need to make one of these the subject. So let's let's say I choose a. Then remember, we have one here, coefficient of b, one all over four. That will be one all over four b. Then we can let's take uh, negative one over four b to the other side. So what are we going to have? We are going to have positive one over four b, which is equals to four a. Then we can divide both sides by four divide both sides by 4. When you divide both sides by 4 here, we are left with a. So let's say 1 over 4 divided by 4. That's 1 all over 16. So we are having 1 over 16b. Okay, this is the second equation. Let's go back to our, our first equation. Uh, we have both of them are equal to a now. So what we could do is saying equation 2 is equal to equation 1 then we'll solve them simultaneously so what was our equation 1 1 over 16 plus 1 over 8 you get 3 all over 16 yes guys 1 over 16 b plus 1 over 8 b that will be 3 all over 16 so it's going to be 3 all over 16 b which is equals to uh, 3 so what we could do here is dividing both sides by 3 all over 16 so what will be b so let's just say 3 divided by 3 all over 16 that will be b will be 16 in this case so we are having b as 16 right we are on the right direction so now we need to find um a what you could do is it's taking this substitute substitute b this goes to 16 into equation one remember your equation one was uh, given as 3 minus 1 over 8 b is equals to a here so what you could do is just saying 3 1 all over 8 then let's place 16 here where there is b then let's see what are we getting so we're having 1 over 8 let me work out the fraction first 1 over 8 multiplied by 16 i'm, I'm having 2 so it's going to be 3 minus 2 which is equals to a so 3 minus 2 that's 1 so now we have our equation of a parabola as uh, as one. So one x squared is the same as x squared uh, plus our b is sixteen all over x, right? So this is the the, the 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 equation. But the most important parts that they were looking for it's a and b. So this is how you were supposed to get it. So and it's true. It, it is. It, it goes with what we said before we begin our um, uh, six point three. We said that uh, this is a parabola. It's a smiling curve, which is true because as we can see, a is positive. Hope you find this uh, videos uh, useful. Actually, this is what this was our um, part two video of six point three. 
yes it's a continuous video if you are new to this channel what are you waiting for let's uh let's do the right thing by subscribing see you on the next video where we are going to work with uh the remaining questions let's see what are the remaining questions that we are going to look at all right let's we are going to look at question seven and question eight so those are the, the the remaining questions that we are going to look at still calculus and there's also an application right um this video will be available on tuesday yes on tuesday it will be available tune for these upcoming two videos then we will start paper two as soon as we are preparing for prelim let's forget about the past remember that let, let the past not affect you but let it teach you to move forward hope you find this video useful don't forget to subscribe you only subscribe once thank you in advance